understand almost all jet skis have a tow restriction of like five miles an hour because of the way that the cooling water comes into the engine when you're getting towed it actually will go in your engine and hurt your engine so if you look online there's plenty of guys out there that are doing this showing how to do it but basically the first step is to find out where your cooling intake line is in my case it's this line back here comes in straight and it connects to this line here there's a sensor here so this used to connect straight to this coupling so I removed it and all I'm doing is adding a heater hose 3 quarter inch ID 7 8 OD you can get it at your hardware store and I'm just rerouting it so what I did was the way these work is this is for go mode and this is for towing mode so basically the water's not going in your engine. I knew I wanted the valve up here because when this platform deck is installed, it ends here. I can take the seat off and put it into towing mode. So all I did was I routed the hoses all around the engine. And I'll show you what I used here. If yours is just straight to the engine, you can actually buy a three quarter inch barb union and cut the hose and then reroute your tow tap kind of hose anywhere you want and then I'll show you what's involved there. You can use the one I have is just gas valve. I mean it's just a ball valve. It'll do the same. It's just to stop water from going in your engine. Here's a shut off for water. Three quarter. And then you can pick up these. You can either get brass or plastic doesn't matter it's not a lot of pressure so barb three-quarter barb by three-quarter male pipe thread this will screw in here and then just hook on your heater hose and a, and a clamp on both sides and now you have a toe tap